Nope. Nope. Salt. How is this curry? What is this? It's short like me. <laughs> wow. Wow. Welcome to another taste test! Whenever I think about instant noodles, the last thing I think about is British instant noodles but believe it or not, they are very popular here. Today I got some of the most popular British instant noodles and see if they're any good. The first one I'm going to try are called pot noodles. I got them in two flavors. The first one is original curry flavor and beef and tomato. Let's open it up and see how it's inside. Oh, it has... I can't see noodles because of the seasoning inside. It looks like cheese. And they have... It, it looks like cheese, like powdered cheese. They have mango sauce. Ooh, why? I have no idea. Why? <laughs> why is the mango sauce there? It smells like spices. It's curry flavor, so it should smell like spices. But where are the noodles? So this needs to stand for two minutes. And meanwhile, let's open the other pot. It comes with tomato sauce. Again, it's filled with flavorings. It smells like ketchup. I don't feel good about this. So it's been two minutes. So let's start eating. Why, Why is, it is it foaming? Why is it so foaming? Oh, it's hot, hot, hot. Oh my god. Let's put in the mango sauce or whatever this is. <laughs> Alright. I'm trying to stay positive, but... This already looks so unappetizing. Okay, it doesn't look that bad after it stopped foaming. <laughs> it has no taste it's like cardboard it has no taste like it has it needs salt and everything else it doesn't taste like curry at all it just this mango sauce thing is giving it just a little bit of sweetness but that's it let's hope this will be better this doesn't have any taste just a hint of sweet mango from the mango sauce yeah. thingy and that's pretty much it let's see if this is foaming tomato <laughs> ketchup really as you can tell more from my face i'm super excited it smells bad <laughs> it smells like cornflakes why <laughs> it, it's supposed to be a tomato it shouldn't smell like cornflakes nope nope it's bad. It's bad. It just tastes like diluted ketchup. Oh god. It smells bad. It smells really bad. So the video got off to a good start. Let's see what happens next. The next one is super noodle. And it's again in curry flavor. They love their curries. It has a very strong smell of mushala. And not in a good way. So it has been cooked for the appropriate amount of time. Let's see. <laughs> doesn't smell appetizing. But the noodle looks much better than the last one. Allergy, it smells like cardamom. It tastes like nothing. It just smells like cardamom. Where is the salt? How is this curry? What is this? The, the noodles texture is better than pot noodles like it doesn't taste like cardboard it's not like you're chewing cardboard but it still lacks flavor let's get naked i mean this is the naked chinese style chow mein egg noodles it looks really good honestly out of all the one this looks the best and so i hope it's better than whatever i tasted till now <gasps> finally it's not doused in flavorings i can see the noodle I hope it tastes like chow mein. So this is what it looks like. It's short like me. <laughs> Where is the salt? No flavor. Also, it smells like narikele tail. Smells yeah. weird, right? It smells very weird. Oh, actually, it does smell like narikele tail. Parachute advertise kora jab Wow. <laughs> wow. I'm sorry you all have to The noodles are bringing out the bad jokes in me. Let's blame the noodles. 
You do not want to see this noodles naked. Naked noodles. Next we have Go noodles. It's in roast chicken flavor. At this point, I just want this to get over. So, oh, it has some flavorings. Chicken flavor. It looks like the instant noodles we know and like. So let's see. Okay, this does not smell bad. It actually smells okay. Why does it look so bland? It literally didn't change any color. I think this is the best we had so far because it has some kind of taste. It has a bit of an artificial flavor, but it's so far the best we had because it tastes of something. It has a bit of flavor. Time for some muck shots. Hate cut the sama jokes to me. So the next one we will give a shot is muck shot. So we have chicken tikka flavored high protein noodles and this is sweet and sticky teriyaki. The flavoring is underneath the noodles. I'll be using a bowl to make this instead of a mug. And it looks horrible. It looks orange. Oh god, why does it look like that? <laughs> it doesn't actually smell bad. It smells like a very mild chicken tikka. Let's see what it tastes like. Taste. A bit like too much gravy and it doesn't taste very instant noodles. It tastes like jhole shatik to noodles de this. Really? Like you had some leftover curry sauce and you just added some noodles to it. I don't hate it. It's not it bad edible? per se. It's edible. Alright guys, as bad as it, it might looks, look, yeah. It's actually it's not actually bad. Edible. It's edible. That's the that's the key word here, edible. Like compared to the other ones, this is like much better, much much better. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Actually, actually, actually Not bad. Actually, actually, that's worth you know having. Let's try the teriyaki one. Why are their gravy so thick? It doesn't this doesn't smell bad as well? Nope. <laughs> nope. They're from the same company. Nope. This so doesn't. Be... Again, it doesn't taste like anything. I'm surprised. Like, how can they make two completely opposite products? Maybe it's the flavor. I don't know. Mmm. Oh, that's bad. Oh, Tita can. It has a bitter aftertaste. It has a very bitter aftertaste. Para plug the set of gula noodles at the budget, I would be able to finish this. Last but not the least, we have kabuto rice noodles. This is the most nicely packaged one, as you can see. It's very cute and small, and it has a proper lid on it. And this is chicken ramen flavor. It smells nice. It's like a glass noodle. It smells nice. It actually smells nice. It smells very sesame-ish. Yeah. Citrusy sesame. Yeah. If that makes sense. Finally, the last one. Let's see if it's any good. It smells nice. Oh, not a bit Okay, the texture of the noodles is very nice. It's very soft. But again, where is the flavor? Now, also a two hint of flavor, I say, but doesn't. Why does none of them taste like like much of anything? I just really like the texture of the noodles, but that that's the only good thing okay. I have to say yeah, about yeah, kabuto noodles. Say, you could say that the noodle texture is good on this one, but flavor-wise, it's like the rest. Honestly. Extremely disappointing. I hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as I did. So of all the ones you had today, which one would you say was... Which one's edible? Yeah. I would have to go with the Mugshots chicken tikka flavor. This was the most edible one. The others one were just... Alright, and... The worst? Yeah, I'm gonna say pot noodle. Pot noodle was probably the worst because it had no flavor whatsoever. The, it was just the beef and it smelled bad. It tasted like cardboard. It just yeah, the beef and tomato pot noodle was definitely by far the worst. So bad. This was not a good day. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Peace.